bebanga funi si si tengi nse. Bine benga kete udu ipo isa obani. Ai, bengu bapa zwap. Uma tuli nto zaku, kata zitati. Atole umbegi nku kata mazishi sabatani petro. Kwa nga si mnandi kumkambule. My name is Fanamo Hashwa. I live here in Soshanguve, a township situated on the northern side of Pretoria. Here, there's a man called Mr. Paul Gambule, a former apartheid policeman who's known for being abusive and cruel to his community members. In 1993, my mother also suffered abuse from Paul Gambule. Back then, she was still working as a petrol attendant. So I've decided to take a journey of knowing Mr. Gambule better and get some answers from him. Thank <laughs> Transfer is one of the places when Kambule used to abuse people. Mangosi is one of them. I was born in 1975 in transfer, We were transferred to the hospital. We So, I was born in the hospital. I was born in the hospital. I was born in the hospital. I was and after what I've heard from Mangosi and my family, I decided to go and speak to him personally. <laughs> I'm so confused because Ngambule kept on promising me and now I'm being kicked out. So what does that mean? After Ngambule refused to give me an interview, I went to his neighbor, Mr. Shabalala. Ngambule refused to give me an interview. Okay. If Ngambule had nothing to hide, then why does he refuse to talk to me? Okay, 
After a long time of begging and getting empty promises, with the help of my father, Gambule finally agreed. Gambule only agreed on two conditions me interviewing him alone and not to ask about the burning of chickens. Okay, it transfer go na ni azeka kan jan mo begi de bo 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 wenza nga kubu la kubu. It transfer. Ah, it transfer besbo pa bo na ma alaba tensa. Ibo ge besbo bo. It transfer ina sa. Ya zuti sa nusu na no mundo lo kulma man. Wena transfer ko wenza gala i. Why transfer to me so? It just. Ma, we have one about their fun. Bigger come with pig sound, me off. It drive home moon. That pig sound was gambled. No man lay like I am. Short man, we born as you, born on gambled. Imagine I just cut it. My baby says, Mas we poison Eli so. I, 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 up to the end. Man, 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 if it was my law, I mean, I've done what long when I fall. When you are the bakala, na ngendo e uti amaho kasi njanja. Noma bona we uti bivanga na malicense. Kuto when you are the boya the extra mile. Ngale yelo melu upambi diba nika kulinto zinja. Hangna daba no muntu ututi. As long as I was doing my job. Ogu ni hangna mso zinja. Okay. Yeah. Manga Chablela for the wooden band, then I'm not doing my job. Gambula doesn't seem to be sorry at all for what he has done. Was it really a must for him to do all those things? Does he realize the pain he has caused to so many people? Does he really care? What am I supposed to learn from him now that he's a man of God? <laughs>